reading my favorite poet here, Sylvia Plath, and um, I'm looking for her reincarnated. Actually, I was talking to them for a little bit on YouTube, um, but they went away, and um, I want to see them again. Anyway, um, here we go. This is one of her um, later poems, Death and Company. Two, of course there are two. It seems perfectly natural now. The one who never looks up, whose eyes are lidded and bald, like Blake's, who exhibits the birthmarks that are his trademark, the scald scar of water, the nude verdigris of the condor. I am red meat. His beak claps sideways. I am not his yet. He tells me how badly I photograph. He tells me how sweet the babies look in their hospital icebox, a simple frill at the neck. Then the flutings are their Ionian death gowns, then two little feet. He does not smile or smoke. The other does that. His hair long and plausive, bastard, masturbating with glitter. He wants to be loved. <sighs> I do not stir. The frost makes a flower. The dew makes a star. The dead bell. The dead bell. Somebody's done for. <laughs> 